Hey everybody, so I am here at EDO today. They are an incredible restaurant in Las Vegas and they have tons of vegan food. They actually just came out with a bunch of new vegan options. So today I'm gonna take you in and show you what they are. Vegan salad uh, that's uh, with the asparagus, arugula, Mm. and uh, beluga uh, lento vinaigrette. Yum, thank you. Mm. That is a perfect summer salad. Perfect. Green tartar. Have a mixture of uh, zucchini, cucumber, avocado puree, micro cilantro, little uh, sapi puricate, crispy rice paper. Lovely. It's got a really unique flavor. I don't know how to explain it. How would you explain this flavor, Roberto? What am I tasting? It's like um, a, the pistachio vinaigrette. Ah, okay. That uh, the nuttiness from the pistachio, I would say, that coming out with uh, the uh, mix, the richness of the avocado. It definitely has a more nutty flavor. And, uh, the mushroom ah. garlic. Ah. So it's a mixture of uh, maitake shimiji mushrooms with the garlic pickle and uh, shavings of cauliflower. Oh, it is so new, uh, but uh, the uh, garlic pickle also is uh, uh, it moves by a little bit. So next we have our minestro vegetables. Okay. It's a uh, Spanish uh, typical, uh, either it's a satay or vegetables or a stew. Uh, it's so simple and beautiful. I mean, look at this. That's so good. It's got like this little kick on the end of your tongue. Oh, wow. I feel like so often you can get a plate of vegetables and you're just like, oh, okay, it's just a plate of vegetables. But like this plate of vegetables is probably one of the most flavorful plates of vegetables I've ever had. It just goes to show you that like with spices and, and sauces and things like you can make just a dish so incredible. So here we have our traditional Spanish paella with uh, broccolini. We have Brussels sprouts and rainbow carrots. Beautiful. Thank you. Wow. So something really cool about this, if you don't want to come and dine in, you can actually get the paella to go. Uh, you put a deposit down on the pan and then you can take it home, heat it up for four minutes, and you have paella at home. It's kind of like eating a warm hug. <laughs> like I don't know how to explain it, like this is a hug and a bowl of rice and a bowl of paella. Strawberry ah. granita with uh, the almond milk yogurt spuma. You have uh, the uh, mixed tamalized tomato, which you have yeah. the candy Like, who knew tomatoes could be dessert? Is what I'm like, I never ever would have thought tomatoes could be a dessert, and yet you have made them into a dessert. I have always thought EDO is one of the best desserts with the mixed tamalized tomatoes, and now they just kind of like upped their game with the granita. Like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, it's really good. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. 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 Thank What a beautiful dessert. Um, it's such a lovely mix of flavors and those mixed tamalized tomatoes, they're sweet. Like I don't think anyone thinks of tomatoes as like sweet and dessert, but EDO has made these tomatoes a dessert and it's so cool that they have. So everything you've seen here today is at EDO. It's on their new vegan tasting menu, minus the paella. The paella is separate and you can order um, all the courses together for $45 or you can go a la carte and then um, you can also, they have an excellent sommelier here. You can do wine pairings, they've got cocktails. You can do it all and have an awesome, awesome vegan dinner at one of my favorite restaurants in Las Vegas.